Hi guys, in this short tutorial, we're going to talk about the green screen feature. I'm going to show you how easy it is to use green screen feature in your preset. All you need to do green screen is a green screen backdrop, a physical backdrop that will be behind your subjects, some continuous lights, we recommend LED lights, just to light to lit your subjects, and of course, the Mirami booth. So let's get started. I created a preset with very minimal uh, things. So I have um, click here to start animation. I have the DSLR photo feature, a preview, and an auto save photo. Um, let's have a look at the photo layout. Of course, I have just the DSLR photo. I will add a background to be replaced by my green screen feature by clicking the add image button and for this tutorial we will use the spaceship cockpit okay um, the ratio here is a little bit different so i'm just going to scale it a little bit okay and i'm going to place it right over here and of course i'm going to grab the this layer the image layer and put it all the way to the back because we are going to use it as a background okay now the next thing I want to do is go to the filters tab and check apply selected filter on all photos and here I will select the green screen filter and I won't touch for now the settings okay if you need to change something with your settings maybe it's not cutting the, the image the right way, chroma key is not working the right way, you, you need to, um, to adjust it or fine-tune it using the amount and threshold um, settings. Okay, I will click save and let's see how it goes. Great! Okay, so it worked out fine. We have a little bit of a green screen over here. Okay, now I want to show you what happens when I try to fine-tune my image, my raw photo. I will open up the Filters tab. And here, as you can see, the chroma key works great. Everything looks okay. But when I try to change the threshold, I can see more details, for instance, on my shirt but it can, you can see little specks of the green screen because it cuts me as well. So as you can see, it gets worse when I um, play around with the amount and threshold. So all you need to do is to take one photo and then fine tune it using the controls. Thanks for joining me and see you next time.